One of the biggest challenges of visiting Mars is the time it takes to get there. Traveling the shortest possible distance, when Earth and Mars are ideally aligned, it takes a spacecraft with current technology about five months to reach the Red Planet, according to NASA. But space agency scientists now say they can cut travel time to Mars to just three days. They will do it, they say, by harnessing the power of light. NASA scientist Philip Lubin and his team are working on a system that would allow space travel to faraway places in just a fraction of the time needed with current technology, he says. The technology would use Earth-based lasers to push spacecraft to speeds greater than 5% of the speed of light to so-called relativistic speeds. None of the current technologies that we're using can get us to relativistic speeds. So we're basically changing the, the way that we enable propulsion by having one very large driving system which can drive um, any class of spacecraft, from very tiny ones to uh, driving extremely large spacecraft that could get to Mars and carry humans. The driving system would use photonic propulsion that relies on the momentum of photons or particles of light to propel objects through space. In contrast to the fuel currently used to launch spacecraft into space, particles of light have no mass, so they wouldn't weigh down the spacecraft. Photons do have energy and momentum, though, and when they reflect off an object, that momentum is transferred into a push. By attaching a large reflective sail onto a spacecraft, light particles could be used to accelerate the craft, Mr. Lubin says. Instead of photons from the sun's rays, though, Mr. Lubin's design would employ an array of small lasers working in synchrony to boost the spacecraft forward. The number of lasers needed would depend on the size of the craft, Mr. Lubin says. He and his team haven't tried their system yet, but their calculations show that with the help of photonic propulsion, a 100-kilogram robotic spacecraft could get to Mars in just three days. A 100-ton mission carrying humans would take about a month, one-fifth of the duration needed today. Mr. Lubin says his aim is to use photonic propulsion for robotic interstellar missions. It will likely take another 30 years to develop affordable technology that would allow that, he says. But ultimately, he thinks, a spacecraft carrying robots could travel to exoplanets at 25% the speed of light and dramatically transform our understanding of the universe. This technology enables us to explore things that we cannot possibly explore today. I just think it's one of the, the beauties of life is that we have the capability to not only dream about such things, but to enable such capabilities in life.